uh, today we're uh, we're filming our uh, our feature link film that uh, my buddy here wrote. The Undead. That is what is happening here today. <laughs> yeah, The Undead. The title is Hungry Eyes. It's a it's a zombie movie slash other cool climaxes is going to be involved in it. And, same towards those that love zombie movies. More or less, it's aimed for the horror fanatics, the people that, that like a good story and don't like just cheese. <laughs> good blood, good quality, good dialogue. Stuff that you can really put into the film festivals for you know circuits and horror for, horror core festivals that are rising up all around the, around the planet. I mean, this this movie could almost be encompassed like a comic book, because comic book movies are really hot right now. And it's structured that way, but it's also you know a horror genre movie, so it kind of feeds to both those crowds, and also. It's pretty entertaining, if I do say so myself. It's a movie that'll make you want to see it twice. So, yeah, that's the key thing. Is like when you're doing zombie movies, everything has pretty much been done. So, before we even got involved in the zombie movie, which is something that we didn't consider doing, we wanted to make sure that we're not doing a typical zombie movie. We wanted to have like a lot of different elements and you know, make it like a fresh on that genre. You, you know, if you can say fresh with zombies, more like, more like rotten fresh. So, you know. Now, originality is really hard to come by nowadays because everybody does homages of everybody else's stuff. So, of course, there's gonna be some things that you recognize here and there, especially if you're from around Coke Mothers local places you'll recognize and Logan Sport too Logan like Sport. today's Logan Sport I know we you know we try to do the surrounding areas like we've you know got mad love for Greentown uh, mad love for Burlington mad love for Logan Sport <laughs> Ten years ago, it might have been a little bit harder to do in this area, but you know now, like we, we seem to be receiving open arms, and we're certainly you know appreciative of that. So yeah, it's pretty much like our, our love letter to Indiana, to our hometown, to so. our hometown. Yep. Yeah. Hoosiers not dead. <laughs> I mean, we got two good Hoosiers right here. <laughs>